Microsoft's new Surface Laptop 5 just got released, receiving very minimal upgrades in terms of design and hardware. While its rig got a bit faster compared to the Surface Laptop 4, is it actually worth upgrading to the Surface Laptop 5? Find out in today's video. Before we go any deeper, let's take a look at the design first. Other than one additional sage green color choice, Microsoft has not brought any significant changes to the new Surface Laptop 5. However, it does look great with the clean minimalist design and slim chassis and you may also find the platinum version of this laptop which comes with an Alicantra fabric covered keyboard as well. Surface Laptop 4 however looks pretty great considering it came out almost one year before the new Surface Laptop 5. The premium aluminum alloy chassis in this laptop definitely adds up to its aesthetic. Also, the Alicantra fabric covered keyboard is only available on the 13.5 inch version. So, if you're interested in a 15 inch version of this laptop, then you have to make an exception here. Besides that, both matte black and platinum colors are available for either version of this laptop. It seems that other than some really great color choices, both laptops look pretty much the same. So, yes, if you're expecting some major aesthetic changes in this new Surface Laptop 5, then you're most likely to get disappointed. Now, the design does not fully determine the quality of a laptop. What really does is the internal specs and performance. Starting off with the Surface Laptop 5, the 12th gen Intel i7 chip was a major change that potentially affected its performance against the Surface Laptop 4. Apart from the chipset upgrade, they also enhanced the quality of the 720p HD camera as well, which definitely promises to ensure some quality conference calls. Another change that is worth pointing out is the new Thunderbolt 4 port which the Surface Laptop 4 did not come with. Other than these few changes, everything is the same as the previous model including the integrated Iris XC graphics, memories up to 32GB and a maximum 1TB storage capacity. And lastly, thanks to a strong battery life, the 13.5 inch Surface Laptop 5 can back you for up to 18 hours while the 15 inch version of this laptop can back you for up to 17 hours straight. In comparison, the only difference in Surface Laptop 4 is the 11th gen Intel processor and LPDDR4 RAM. Everything else is more or less the same, including the battery life which can straight up deliver 19 hours of backup. As we move on to the display, we see that Microsoft is using the same display for both of these devices. A 15-inch pixel sense touchscreen display with 2256 by 1504 resolution. But this time around, the Surface Laptop 5 screen does feature Dolby Vision IQ3 which provides automatic adjustment to the display color settings. So, it's clear that the new Surface Laptop 5 and Surface Laptop 4 pretty much use the same display except for one feature which isn't really that much of a deal. And that leads us to our main and final part which is the price tag. The starting price of the 13.5 inch Surface Laptop 5 is $999 while the Surface Laptop 4 costs only $799. So the price gaps between these two devices are almost $200. So within this $200 price tag, you're only getting a new processor and a brighter display for an upgrade. Maybe if they could bring other changes such as adding a 1080p resolution camera and replacing the Intel XC graphics chip, then it would have been a solid upgrade for most of the Surface users. So that was all about today's comparison between the Surface Laptop 5 versus Surface Laptop 4. Thanks for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, Please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.